I'm gonna give you a quick tour of my bass boat, okay? This is a Bass Cat Margay. This boat is 17 foot, seven inches. And the reason why I have a boat that's 17 foot, seven inches is because I need to fit in my garage. My garage is only 20 foot, only 20 foot long. And I got a water heater and all kinds of other stuff in the garage. So I need something to put my, have a nice boat right here to go into the garage. I don't want the sun to fade it and I want to pay rent. The last thing I want to do is pay rent on anything, right? It costs us a waste of money. So uh, basically keep it in the garage. You can keep your battery charged the whole time. It just makes a huge, huge difference. Now this bass boat will go 65 miles per hour. That's right, 17 foot, seven inches, 65 miles per hour. That is hauling butt for a small boat. And uh, basically, let's look at the back end and I'll show you why. I have a 150 Yamaha, all right, VMAX. That thing will haul butt, gets off the, gets on plane real fast. But uh, hey guys, that's how it works. Okay, so I also have power poles in the back. Whoo, I'm about to fall down. Man, I tell you what, guys, these things, these things right here, those are a must have right there, buddy, I tell you. I, I'm glad I put an investment in uh, buying power poles for, uh, for this boat because it's really, really worth your money. So, right here, I keep uh, some lures. I got some other stuff and right here is a toilet bowl cleaner right here right so i use this to clean the grass and weeds away from my engine uh, before i go it gets all clogged up man this thing works great back here you got a 26 gallon fuel tank you have uh, two batteries for your trolling motor you got another battery for your starting engine and then you have your oil right here and this is for your uh, power poles all right so a lot of room in the back you know for uh for this size boat definitely plenty of room you got live wells these things are huge live wells. I mean, Mac, these are, I call these uh, Mac, Mac Daddy live wells. I mean, uh, basically you can put tournament fish in here, keep your fish alive. I do have an oxygenator right here. That, they, that works great. Um, so that's the live wells. Up front, of course you got two chairs and you got a console right here, a whole bunch of all kinds of all kinds of knickknacks. So uh, yeah, not organized. Um, up front, you got a fiberglass console, nice steering wheel. I mean, this thing is, is high quality. If you look at, if you look at most of the bass boats like, out there, like a Nitro, uh, other, other boats are like made out of plastic, right? They got a plastic console. Bass Cats, high quality. I mean, they, I mean, this one reason, number one reason why I bought a Bass Cat was quality. I mean, you just cannot beat the quality in this bass boat. So I got a hot foot right down here and uh let's go up so right here's a cooler not too bad keep all your drinks and this right here keep all your fishing rods of course i don't have all my rods in there they're all sitting right here i'm uh trying to film a fall fishing trip a fall video right now fall fishing video um so right now this thing will hold a lot of rods look at all these rod holders i mean a ton of rods got some storage all kinds of different lures and all kinds of worms Man, all kinds of stuff here. All right. And you have the same thing on the other side. And I usually keep like my, my cameras and stuff. I got my drone and my box right here. All that stuff. So. And I tell you what, this deck is very long. I mean, whoo. Check this out, guys. I'm six foot one. I'm six foot one. Oh. The camera piece broke. It didn't break, but it's popped off. But look, guys, I'm I'm uh I'm six one, right? And this is where my feet is. I mean, my legs are kind of come up a little bit, but it's not bad. It's got a 90 inch beam uh, on the boat, so 90 inch beam. This guy right here, uh, I'd say there's plenty of room for me. And uh, I mean, I, I mainly fish by myself anyway. I do carry some friends with me, but the back deck's got plenty of room. And guys, this is plenty of room right here. This is just ridiculous to uh, to fish. Motor guy, trolling motor right here up front. Got the uh, fish finder. I really, I never use a fish finder at all up front. I don't know why. I guess because all the lakes that I go to, I know already. I know the, I know the depth and so forth. Um, this is for the uh, power poles right here. If I hit it twice, they come up in the back. And then when I want them to go down when I fish, it's like that. Hey guys. They go down, that's how it works. Um, but I tell you, the quality of the bass cat 
I mean, this is a dirty bass cat right now. I've been fishing all morning, but I'll tell you what, guys. I, I will say the quality of a bass cat is, 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 is high. It's very high compared to the other bass boats. I mean, I know there's a lot of nice ba bass boats out there. Definitely a lot of nice bass boats. Um, but for a 17-foot, 7-inch bass boat, I mean, this is not a 20-foot bass boat. 20, you know, 21 foot bass boat where you pay like $80,000 for. Uh, they are expensive, but I bought a used boat. All right. Why did I buy used? Man, it's ridiculous to pay that high price. Go ahead and drop, you know, five, five to $8,000 by uh, getting a two or three year old boat. Save money, right? I'm all about saving money. You got to invest that money for your future. Guys, if you do buy a Margay or if you buy a Bass Cat product, I, I'm just saying the quality is just ridiculous. Go to your Bass Pro, go to your Bass Pro, check out your Nitro, and then go look at a Bass Cat. And you tell me the feel of the fiberglass, the quality of the console, and all the components, is there a difference? I promise you, there's a huge difference. But anyway, guys, that's it for the boat tour. I hope you enjoyed it. And like always, I'll catch you on the next video. I'm going fishing. As a matter of fact, I'm going to let this video run into that fishing video. All right, guys, take it easy. We're going to go do some fall, fall fishing in Florida. Bye-bye. Ooh, got a hit. Guys, this is a big one. This is a big one. Oh my God. Guys. Oh my God. Oh my God, guys. Oh my goodness. I think this is my biggest bass. Oh my God. Look at that! Holy smokes! Uh, uh. Guys, look at this! Look! Holy smokes, guys! Woo!